The community is coming together to help a family that lost three kids in a house fire. Michelle Fiore is in Sheboygan talking to people who came out to raise money. A few here know the Mackey family, but most do not. But they all came together in this room to share a brat and a burger in their name. It's a well-organized operation. Hey, here's a single. Take it. Feeding a lunch crowd. I'll take one single. Double. Touched by the tragic story at this Sheboygan Falls home, staff decided to hold a brat fry and call it Ray of Hope. The response was overwhelming. Businesses sent a thousand burgers, three thousand brats, balloons, and flowers, and students made these tasty treats. One day we did 15 dozen chocolate chip cookies, and then a group came down and did about a hundred uh, Rice Krispie bars, and so we have everything individually wrapped, and it's all sold. Chris and Christy Mackey were at Bible study when their home caught fire last month, killing seven-year-old Carter Mackey, ten-year-old Ben Martin, and eleven-year-old Natalie Martin. I'd be a mom of five, you know. It's just like. I can't imagine. Natalie's the hero who rescued her nine year old sister Jenna, but died trying to save her brothers. Classmates at Farnsworth Middle School miss her. She is nice and she is a sweetheart. Natalie's classmates got a ride to the Brat Fry because they too wanted to help. I hope they think it's good and stuff so we can raise a lot of money for her family. The Mackeys did not attend today's fundraiser. Organizers hope that they see all of this and feel the love that the community has for them. In Sheboygan, Michelle Fiore, today's TMJ4. I'm sure they do. Thank you, Michelle.